What is up, you shoe fanatics? My name is Izzy, and you guys are watching Cell Snickers. What is up, you shoe fanatics? My name is Izzy, and today I'll be showing you how to cop Supreme Spring Slash Summer 2019 items for retail using a Google Chrome extension. If you guys can do me a huge favor, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Definitely helps me make more content in the near future. And most importantly, guys, if you guys can like this video that I just made, that helps a lot too. And if you guys have any questions, comments, or concerns, go ahead and leave a comment down in the comment section below. All right, guys, let's get straight to the video. All right, guys, so today's video, I'm going to basically show you how to have different methods on obtaining um, Supreme clothing for retail prices. Today, it's going to be mostly focused on a Chrome extension thing. But I'm also going to give you guys some other tips and advices to do if you're not able to get a hold of a computer. First thing I recommend is go ahead and go and log on to your Google account. Now it is an optional thing, but I definitely would recommend it. The next thing you want to do is you're going to go ahead and insert this uh, link that I'm going to be doing and putting down in the uh, description of the video. So what we want to look for is called a program called Cantu Browser Automation. What you want to do is go ahead and download this thing really quick. It's going to be on the top right once it's finished. You should have this little um, logo. So you're going to want to have that ready. You're going to go ahead and uh, only stay on one tab now, okay? So you're going to go ahead and exit this out. Go on the Supreme website. Go on to the shop. Then on the lower right, you're going to go view all. For this example or this purpose, I'm going to go ahead and pick a pant because usually these are the ones that don't really sell. So I'm going to go ahead and click that. Go to checkout. And then what you're going to want to do, um, first things first, is uh, you want to go to your settings on your Google. And you want to make sure that your show bookmarks is uh, enabled. Another thing that I would also recommend, if this isn't working for you guys too, is also set up your autofill, which, which should be in advanced settings. And then you're going to want to go to autofill settings. And here's my information right here. I'm going to blur it out but you can add it onto your thing and that also helps you when you're on Supreme on, on a website either at your school, your house, or anywhere that you're able to have access to the internet. Alright, let's get back to the video. Alright guys, so once you guys are in the car, when you got any random item that you just had to uh, process, you're going to want to go ahead and open up the Cantu program. Alright, first thing you want to do is go hit new macro and all you want to do is hit record. Now once you're recording, go ahead and put your information down. So I'm going to go ahead and put mine. Uh, now this isn't my real phone number or anything like that. I'm just using it for a purpose. Address. Get money. Dot. Awesome. USA. Now nah, I don't. I would recommend you guys go ahead and click that, and then putting your credit card information. Pick anything random. I'm just picking whatever. And then make sure you click "I have read and agreed to the terms and conditions." Now you're gonna give it a little bit of moment. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and let this finish because you want to make sure that every um, command was recorded. So I'm gonna let this uh, keep going until it's done. You'll know when it's done when it stops doing its own thing. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, give it two more seconds. It might take a little while depending on how fast your computer is running. Now mine has been slow for uh, a little bit, so it's going to take a little bit of time. Alright guys, so once that's done with your notifications, you're going to go ahead and hit stop right record. You want to uh, save it. Now I'm going to go ahead and put... Supreme 2018 checkout autofill. You know, go ahead and hit save. And now make sure your settings are set to this. You're going to want to have it medium 0 0.3 delay, 60 seconds, 10, 300, and 60 again. And then make sure these are enabled besides this one. And then you're going to go ahead and uh, exit out. Now this should be saved as a bookmark, so that's why I told you in the beginning of the video. Uh, make sure you have it on here. So you're going to go here, go to bookmarks, and then you should have it down there. But I actually forgot to enable it on it, so I'm going to go ahead and show you how to do that. Alright, so here is mine. You're going to want to click on this, and you're going to go to add shortcut to bookmarks. Click OK. 
Okay, so that what it does is it creates a bookmark into your thing. So you can either go here on your favorites thing, and it should be located right here, or you could go on to the options page, go to bookmarks, and then it's also located down here. All right, so we're gonna reload the page real quick. Check out. Now I'm gonna show you how it is in action. All right, so you're gonna be on here. All you wanna do, click the Chrome extension thing that you made with your bookmark. Click on that. Then click on your thing, and it should be working now. All right, so that was pretty quick, pretty fast, pretty simple. Um, this has definitely helped me a lot. I use this a lot of times, and um, it usually gets me through the thing. I think you just process the payment, and you're pretty much done. Now I'll give it maybe another second or two before they try to decline you because uh, Supreme does probably think that this is a bot or something, even though it's not. So I would definitely recommend you wait a second or two until you're able to process your payment. Um, if this doesn't work for you guys, like I said, the best thing to also do is just make sure that you set your um, autofill on. I go all the way down here, go to advanced settings. Whoops. And then you're going to just want to go to autofill settings and just want to enable that. I put my information down, so here it is right here. So that usually helps me when I'm typing something, but it's just a little bit slower. The other thing I would recommend you guys doing is... Um, actually going onto your mobile app and downloading this um, application called Restocks. Restocks is another um, application that pretty much does an autofill thing. Um, they have Supreme on there and other websites that help you check out. So I would definitely create an account with them and then just putting your information there. So if you're ever at school or you're not at the computer, go ahead and just uh, download that app. The other thing that I also recommend about this app would also be the fact that you're able to get notified when another item is um, restocking on either Supreme or, like I said, any other websites. If this video helps, guys, make sure you guys leave a comment down in the section below. And if you guys have any questions, comments, or concerns, don't hesitate to comment down there either. Make sure you guys like this video in case if, if it helped you guys. And uh, let me know what other videos I can make for you guys. You guys have an awesome day, and I'm out.